Because procrastination is a sin, you guys. It's not of God to procrastinate. And if you remember correctly, I just told y'all it took me a year. And I've been through so many things for being disobedient and for procrastinating. Procrastination is connected with poverty, she said. Do not procrastinate. If this has been placed on your mind to do, do it. What is up, y'all? It's me, Kamari, and I'm back with another video. Y'all can't even see my butt. Well, you can see it when I'm back up. But um, I'm in the process of doing my eyebrows. Anyways, I wanted to come on here because I feel like it was about three weeks ago. I was up here talking to y'all about, um, you know, I was contemplating quitting my job and things like that and um, stepping out on faith. Hold on. Um, stepping out on faith and things like that. But y'all, I've been doing that. So it's been things that I've been wanting to do for a long time that I've been talking about and never did it. And I'm talking about, it's been a year now. It's been a year since I've talked about those things and never, 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 never made any steps towards getting them done. Um, so, you know, I actually did go ahead and quit my job. Something happened with my child. I was 40 minutes away from her. Talk about the worst 40 minutes of my life scared the living daylights out of me, okay? I'm talking about I had to call the name of Jesus um, for 40 minutes as I was on my way to her. And um, it, that was confirmation because I had to go to work that very next morning. Well, me and my daughter didn't leave the hospital till 2 o'clock that morning. And I was supposed to be in work at 6 o'clock. Long story short, I didn't go. And I actually never returned. Um, so this happened right after that video I posted. This happened that same weekend. Um, yeah, this happened that same weekend, y'all. The day before school, uh, she was in the hospital. And I'm not going to go into no details in no way, shape, or form about that situation. Um, if you want to pray um, and you have a relationship with God. And um, I'm talking about a Christian. I'm not talking about nothing else. Anyways, I don't want to get into that. Um, but to God be the glory, my daughter is fine. Both of my kids, all three of my kids are fine. Um, but you know, things had to happen. And I told y'all in that video, God was showing me. And he did. He showed me I didn't need to be there. And I was right. I need to be home. I need to be home with my kids. I need to be on when they at school. I'm 10 minutes away. That's, that's, <laughs> that's perfect for me. I'm 10 minutes away when I at school. So, But I wanted to come on here and talk to y'all. Um, first of all, if you're new here, hey, welcome to my channel. My name is Kamri. I'm a mom of three. And as you can tell, they are my whole entire world, okay? Um, I have been selling digital products. I've been selling pre-cut photos. A lot of people do not know what that is. But a lot of people do because my one of my... Um, videos with the most views is a video explaining pre-cut photos and making charms and everything like that so i will probably link that to this video um just in case you want to know like what is that um but moving right along i've been selling physical physical um sheets physical items let's just say and now i am I have transitioned to digital and I've been thinking about doing that forever. I've been saying I need to get those sheets and make them downloadable. I've been saying I want to create these ebooks to help people um, monetize on YouTube and you know with social media. I've had people inbox me saying why don't you um, be a social media coach and I was like I'm not where I want to be to be doing that and she told me you might not wear, be where you want to be, but you are where someone else wants to be. And that resonated with me. And I've been thinking on it and things like that. And I'm here I am doing it. So the sheets that I wanted to make digital are digital. Um, I am going to make pre-cut photos for breast cancer awareness again because that's very important to me as well. I have a lot of family members who have um, suffered from with cancer. 
and so yeah i am gonna make those both physical and digital um physical only for a limited amount of time um but i just wanted to talk to you about transitioning it because whatever you do physically there's something that you can sell digital because digital products is going to be um very helpful to you because it's all profit okay it don't cost you anything to create it initially like your setup and everything like that so i do have an ebook that tells you exactly how to create an ebook i will link that in the um, description box as well but i wanted to talk to you just in case you're thinking about it like you know i sell digital um physical products but what could i do to be digital like for instance if you are a makeup artist um you could sell an ebook like, I'm sorry, my phone had, my storage got full. But, um, yeah, if you are a makeup artist, you can literally make an ebook on how to create a booking site or how I got my clientele up, especially, like, if you have, everybody has a journey. Like, you start somewhere and then you progress. If there are certain strategies you use, certain things you did, like, you know, I did a giveaway. I did a few people's hairstyles for the free. I did a celebrity, um hair that makeup whatever i said makeup artist but whatever whatever it is you do physically there is something you could take and create a digital item and that will help you because there is no startup fee there is no inventory there's nothing but your time so it's it's smart work and it takes time for you to create it but you create it without one time and then you sell it and of course you got to come up with marketing strategies and everything else like that but there are resources out there there are resources out there for that i feel like if you have a clientele definitely if you already have a good clientele add a digital item okay all profit and it's not it's like it's just the most convenient thing possible but i i have to share something with y'all you guys because i was on tiktok scrolling and I seen, I came across this lady. I wish I knew her name right now, but I can't think of her name right this moment. If I figure it out, I'll put it in this video. But she um, shared on her TikTok that it is procrastination is a sin, you guys. It's not of God to procrastinate. And if you remember correctly, I just told y'all it took me a year to do, do you know what I'm saying? I've been through so many things for being disobedient and for procrastinating procrastination is connected with poverty she said do not procrastinate if this have been placed on your mind to do do it i have ebooks links in the description box if you feel led to do this and entrepreneurship is something that you've been tap um trying to tap into do it do it and if god told you that you can do it who are you to say you can't not believing in yourself is not believing in him because he chose you to do it so it's like who am i to tell god i'm not qualified who am i to tell god i'm not the woman for the job if he said hey yes you are i told you to do it you didn't do it and you better do it now like i'm gonna make it so you gotta do it you guys like i just went through a whole lot i worked at a job i was completely unhappy with um and I'm not going to go into details about that job at all because guess what it did? It got me where I needed to be, which I needed to move. I moved. And yeah, but the rest, oh, the rest of the way I'm going to be obedient, okay? Um, Stay tuned, you guys. I do have things coming out. I have um, a calendar coming out for content creation. I just released the ebook to help you get monetized on YouTube. I just wanted to encourage somebody to transition from physical to digital. And that does not mean stop doing the the physical thing that you do if you offer a service or if you um, ship out, you know, you selling products and shipping them out. I'm not telling you not to do that, okay? Because you need multiple incomes, okay? Whoever said you just need one, I don't really know what they were on. I don't know what they were talking about. You need multiple streams of income. You need to sell digital items. That's pretty much it for this video. Go ahead and like, comment, subscribe. Leave me a comment down below and let me know something. Okay, what you gonna do? You gonna, you gonna do this or what? Also, I need you to check out the links in my description because I do, I do have a TikTok shop now. Um, 
I'm new to TikTok shops, so you know. But anyways, um, be sure to follow me on social media accounts. I literally just created a new Facebook like today. So I will try to link that for you guys as well.